Hello everyone, this is Anubhuti from Sensitive.com. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi. And I hope you stay and uh, join this family. And uh, today I am doing a uh, year and check-in for my Project Pen 10 products. Mm, this is a um, very common uh, Project Pen idea in throughout the YouTube and over the Instagram. A lot of people do it and a lot of people have their own rules and way of doing it uh for me it's just the way it works out that i pick up uh 10 products at a time and then i keep working on them it is a rolling project pen which means i pick up 10 products assign some goals to them if when i hit those goals i roll out those products and add new products so at a point of time there are 10 um products i'm gonna continuously working on so uh, at the start of the year i chose a few products which i decided uh, some goals on and then throughout the year i added a lot of products i did not uh, manage to do um, check-ins every month uh, next year i will probably do better on that department but then i did uh, keep a track of those things on my laptop on my excel sheet and then that's where i'm going to uh, show you from so um, the first product which I chose was Ilamaska Beyond Veil uh, Glowing Gel Primer and uh, the goal was to finish that product and I achieved that goal by end of January uh, then I had another foundation which was L'Oreal Glam Beige Healthy Glow Foundation and and then the goal was to finish it up which i also managed to do by end of january itself and then i also had max studio fix concealer in nc35 um the goal was to hit pan on it and i did uh, hit pan on it and then i kept working through it so there's not much left uh, and also the lid is broken so i will probably put it in back to mac pile yeah so i wish to hit uh, the goal on this one as well by end of january and then i had a sense i love extreme crazy volume mascara um the goal was to finish that one up and i managed to do it by end of march I do own a lot of colored um eye pencils so then my goal was to hit get use um some of them so then they could don't get bad because uh, i used to be more of a colored eyeliner culture kind of a person and not much of an eyeshadow wearer but ever since i moved here um, my makeup preferences have changed and i decided to use up my products before they start to go bad and in that uh, way of um, like doing my makeup i started using more eyeshadows and i enjoyed the process so then i realized that i am not using my colored liners or pencils as much as i would like to or i used to do so then i decided to put a few of them in the project here so then uh one of the eye pencils was um face is canada along their eye pencil in the shade navy blue and i did manage to um, and hit the goal on it by end of january so these are the products I chose in this month of January. The sixth product was Deborah Milano Lip Liner in Shimmer Pink. <laughs> this lip liner was really, really hard to finish because I am not the one who wears lip liners uh, quite often. And for so for me to get through a lip liner is quite tough. I, I used to wear the lip liners before, but then now I don't anymore. And then now I want to finish up um, the ones which i have in my uh, vanity so then i decided to put it in the in my project pen this year as well it was my in my project pen last year as well but um this year also i put a goal to finish it up and um i rolled it in the starting of the year and i managed to finish that lip liner by end of october 25th of October so that's a really long time it took me 10 months to get, and get over that lip liner and it was not a big one it just a small size lip liner which um yeah that shows how rarely I use the lip liners um then uh, the seventh product a uh, seventh and eighth product was uh makeup revolution blush palette sugar and spice and I decided to put two of the shades two of the nude shades uh, pinky nude and brownie nude um, I have since then I have depotted uh, the palettes and uh, during that process I had to repress the shades 
but um, I did manage to uh, hit pan on the pinky nude shade and then I still have to put uh, hit the pan on the brownie nude shade but I'm not sure how I'm going to uh, count that because I had to repress it so I think it's going to take a longer time to hit the pan on it I was pretty close um, on that one to hit the pan but now I'm not sure Probably I have, I will have to repress these again because the, the pans are kind of mm, uh, kind of shifted and just not even product. Um, I'll see. It's just getting a little bit tougher to pick up the product on brush, so I'll see what I have to do. But then that's the progress on these ones. Um, then so two faced chocolate soleil bronzer uh, from Holiday Edition. 2019 and Too Faced uh, Angel Wings Highlighter but that was also from the Holiday 19. So that was this compact. It was a duo, highlighter and bronzer duo and I did manage to hit pan on both of the products. So highlighter I was able to hit pan uh, in the month of January itself and uh, uh, the bronzer took me a long time uh, but by the month of June I was able to hit man on it. I was using it uh, as my dedicated bronzer so that mm, this is quite tightly pressed. So mm, yeah, it took me a long time to hit man on this. Mm, but the highlighter I still enjoy and I did make a lot of progress through the pans and I think I will be able to finish it up probably in the next year. Smells fine and yeah so I, I absolutely love these both products so then i am going to be working on these in the upcoming year as well um so these were the 10 products which i picked initially and um i was able to hit a goal on everyone except the brownie nude blush from the makeup revolution palette um but then as i hit pan on hit goals on my products i rolled a couple of new products as well one of them was oriflame wearing me eye pencil duo which was purple and it was a duo pencil when one side had a lilac clip uh, eyeliner and the other one has kind of an eggplant shade um and i did manage to hit goal on that i was able to finish that pencil uh, by end of november somewhere around 19th of november so that is uh, the one then i had another one faces canada along with eye pencil copper like i said i was trying to use up uh, some of my eye pencils and then um, i rolled it in in month of february used it quite a lot i used it almost half of the pencil and then i almost forgot about it and then i picked it up again in month of october and november and then i realized this was it this that was just dried up um, it was tugging on my eye eyelids and then just completely dried up and uh, so I decided to declutter it. I used two third of the pencil by the way. Um, I used two third of that um, eye product so I'm pretty happy that I got some use out of it. It was brand new when I moved it into the project pan. Um, then uh, I also rolled in three um, of the lipsticks, three of the mini lipsticks from Kiko Milano, uh, the holiday range from the last year. Uh, I kept one for the reference here. So these are the three lipsticks which I uh, rolled in the project pen. The shades were 01, 02 and 03. And I managed, the goal was to finish all these lipsticks and I managed to uh, finish all of them. Um, I dug out uh, the products from all of them and I use them up so um, yeah these were the three lipsticks as well uh, which I managed to hit the goal on so and that's amazing um, and uh, after after that I decided to uh, because I hit goal on the products I decided to move in another product uh, in month of June um, uh, that was uh, my L'Oreal Lip and Cheek Palette uh, Cheek Biscuits. Um, it's basically a liquid uh, cream kind of palette which can be used as a lipstick or um, a blush. And the goal was to hit pen of hit pen on all of the eight shades. I did manage to hit pen on two of the shades. 
um two of the shades one is this uh, beautiful hibiscus kind of shade and the other one is a uh, nudie peach so these are the two shades i have managed to hit pan on i am also close to hit pan on uh probably um two more shades but i um, so far two done and six to go but then i don't think so it will be possible for me to hit um go on all of these shades uh, probably i can hit a uh, pen on an additional three more shades um so yeah um, that's my progress so far um let's see how it goes and another other uh, product which i moved into my project pen was an uh, again from l'oreal base magique transforming soothing primer this primer has been passed down to me uh, by my friend she does not use much makeup and she gave me this when it was almost full and then i did make a lot of progress on it there is a very little bit of it left and i do plan to finish it by end of this year and i am pretty uh, positive about it because this was pretty old in her connection as well and this has been with me for about a year now so i do want to finish it up before um end of this year so that is another product which is in the goal that is about it those are all the products i have been working on as part of this uh project pen uh 10 products so if i see the stats at the moment i have i did manage to hit goal on uh two of the products by almost end of november so i have not picked up um any new products for now so in the year i have managed to hit a uh, goal on a total of 16 products most of them were to finish or hit pan on so then i managed to uh, hit goal on 16 of the products and um, right now there are eight active uh, products in my um, project pan the two new products which I'm rolling in uh, now are uh, MAC lipsticks. And these are both minis, two MAC lipsticks. Both are mini. One is um, their, from their MAC range. Uh, it is Velvet Teddy. And this is my absolutely favorite shade. There is um, this much bullet left on top of it. And then uh, my goal is to use up uh, uh, till it gets flat um in the bullet and then after that probably if i need i will dig it out and uh, depot it in somewhere but then the goal uh, i'm giving myself is just to use it up uh, what is completely on top of the bullet so that is my goal for both of these the other shade is from the satin range and it is the sh uh, lipstick in twig both of these are almost like same amount of uh, lipstick is left and then for both of them i'm giving the goal to use it up completely uh, on the top of the bullet i these are my absolutely loved lipsticks from uh, mac uh, so that is it uh, so and now i have active 10 products and then uh, these are the 10 products i have i will be working on which means uh, six uh, blush shades from uh, this palette and then Mm, one shade brownie nude shade from the blush palette and then two of the lipsticks and one uh the primer so these are the 10 products i will be uh working on uh from in month of december and also um will roll it over the project pan the same products will roll over to 2023 um i will roll in a few products when i have um, managed to when i'll be able to hit go on some of these items and uh, at the same time i will try to do a check-in with you guys at this point i'm just rambling so if you like this video or if you like this kind of content please uh, subscribe to my channel hit give this video a thumbs up and um, uh, stay tuned uh, for more such videos